Okay, hey, maybe you've had this experience. Your neighbor spends a ton of cash on a home renovation and suddenly you're thinking, hmm, I need to fix up my place too. A lot of us are so guilty of playing that comparison game. So how can we stop? Rachel Cruz is the author of Know Yourself, Know Your Money, and she is here to tell us how we can quit that game. Hi there, Rachel. Great to see you. You too, Anna. Thanks for having me on. So we're bombarded on social media. Everybody's showing their flashy new toys. How can we stop comparing ourselves? And it is a hard game, and it's a hard thing today. You know, you think back 30, 40 years ago and keeping up with the Joneses, you actually had to see the Joneses in person to keep up with them, right? But now we carry them around in our back pockets on our phones. It's everywhere. And so my encouragement always to people is where, where you can put the blinders on, do it and just say, hey, regardless of what everyone else is doing, I'm really going to focus my time and my energy on my family, on my money, on my situation. And that may mean possibly deleting social media for a little bit, maybe unfollowing certain people that kind of causes that. But what you can do to insulate yourself to say, hey, I'm going to focus on being content. And contentment is, it's kind of a, a theoretical world at times word that it's, it's hard to grasp. But for me, I have found when I am grateful and start with gratitude. And I actually look at other people around me and say, hey, how can I help give and serve to other people? Those two things really lead me to contentment. And I've just found that 